Good morning from Carolina Bulletin. I'm Prom Bird. And I'm LG. We're going to start you off with events in the Grand Strand. Are you a cosplayer, comic book fan, or just want something cool to do this fall? Join us for the second annual Grand Strand Comic Con on November 16th and 17th from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. Hosted by DJ's Decals at Inland Square Mall in Merle's Inlet, South Carolina, there will be over 100 vendors and artists, cosplay contests, food trucks, and more. Carolina Bulletin will be there again to cover the event. We'll be doing trivia games and giving away prizes at our table. So stop by to test your knowledge and to meet the masterminds behind our operation. Tickets are on sale now at eventbrite.com. Over to you, Algy. Here with the Republican Conway, South Carolina is showing the smash hit Tinky Boots the Musical this month. Based on an exhilarating true story about the struggling shoe factory that will lift your spirits to high-heeled heights. There's still a chance for you to see it with three more performances until October 27th. If you like rap, Mo Beats is bringing his style of music to the Theater Republic on October 25th. This internet sensation rapper will be performing with DJ Flame. Buy tickets and see showtimes at theaterofthepublic.com. That reminds me of my younger years when I was in the group Seaweeds in the early 90s. We were true pioneers of the aquatic rap scene. Now back to you, Prom Bird. Here are this month's interesting stories in the Carolinas. A deer became an unlikely home intruder in North Carolina. Nash County deputies say they found an unwanted guest relaxing in the home's hallway. The photo of the deer in the hallway drew lots of jokes on Facebook like, He's just getting specks of houses for Santa. In Clemson, South Carolina, strong winds sent restaurant employees flying into the air. This happened when employees were trying to secure a tent to the ground during a storm. The two employees were swept off their feet, and one of them was flung up as high as the roof of the club they were working at. Both of them are recovering, and the man was lucky to just get stitches and several cuts and bruises. I bet neither one of them will complain about their work not being exciting enough. South Carolina DNR is asking anglers to kill and report northern snakehead sightings. Recently in Georgia, a fisherman caught this invasive species. Originally from the Asian continent, the northern snakehead is a freshwater fish that can survive for a period out of water. It looks like a bowfin, but with a longer fin and scales like a snake. If you're fishing in the south and happen to see one, report it immediately to the Department of Natural Resources. That fish looks scary. Wouldn't want to run to one of them where I'm from. And now it's time to pay some bills. We'll be back right after these words. The Bagel Factory now has five locations open for breakfast and lunch throughout the Grand Strand. 2012 North Kings Highway in downtown Myrtle Beach. 763 Main Street in North Myrtle Beach. 2112 Oak Heart Road in Carolina Forest. 1620 Farrell Parkway in Market Common. And now... 11 9 20 highway 701 in merle's inlet stop in for delicious bagels fresh coffee mouth-watering lunch sandwiches the bagel factory is a carolina bulletin top pick ok sports marketing has 25 years of experience working to bring groups families and co-workers together to some of the biggest names in sports entertainment get tickets to the super bowl the masters the daytona 500 the MLB All-Star Game, plus all the Carolina Panthers and Hurricane games. Any ticket you want, OK Sports can deliver it. Call 843-503-8413. That's 843-503-8413. Don't forget to ask about our VIP packages. From putting the green, the putting the green, to the end zone, we cover all your bases. OK Sports Marketing is a Carolina Bulletin top pick. With so much to offer, the OD Arcade and Lounge is a favorite hangout of both locals and visitors. Food and drink specials for happy hour, Monday through Saturday from 4 until 8. Enjoy karaoke Sundays and Thursdays, live bands, pool tables, state-of-the-art games, shag dance events, and plenty of TVs for your big game. OD provides entertainment for the entire family. Located right by the water on 100 South Ocean Boulevard in North Myrtle Beach. It's the OD Arcade and Lounge, a Carolina Bulletin top pick. Welcome back. Have you heard about VR education? Imagine swimming with sharks. 
visiting outer space, going to a virtual museum, or exploring the human body. Places like Cavern Virtual Reality and Myrtle Beach, South Carolina are using virtual reality to bring vivid experiences like these to the classroom in the form of STEM field trips. Virtual reality has the power to transform learning by giving students an interactive three-dimensional learning environment. That sounds way more fun than your average field trip. You can learn more about STEM field trips at Cavern by calling them at 843-236-8797 or emailing info at cavernvr.com. Now it's time to hear a review from our food critic, Robbie the Rib. Let me tell you about the Breadwood Restaurant in Little River, South Carolina. I had a lobster date during there, Lobster Desna, which was on Tuesdays and Thursdays. I enjoyed listening to cool jazz and sounds of Scott Watkins. The lobster bake includes one main lobster, shrimp, mussels, and dewy sausage, corn on the cob, and bread potatoes. Mmm, what a delight, low country cuisine. Reservations are highly recommended on account of the lobster selling out so fast and all. Over to you, Algie. If you thought all the party was done last weekend, you're in for a treat. And maybe some tricks, too. OD Arcade and Lounge much anticipated Halloween party is held on the 31st to celebrate the spookiest holiday the right way. Located in downtown North Myrtle Beach, South Carolina, party starts at 9 and runs to 1 a.m. Make sure you wear your best costume and enter the 21 and over costume contest. The best overall costume wins $500 and the sexiest and scariest costumes both win $200. There's other prizes involved so show up ready to win. Enter as a group or individually. Over to you, Prime Bird. That sounds like a blast. I'll wear my finest tuxedo. Speaking of costumes, if you're looking for a kid-friendly activity, Brook Green Gardens is having an exciting imagination walk on Saturday, October 26th at 12 p.m. to 2 p.m. Wear your favorite costume and enjoy a fun-filled guided sculpture garden tour and scavenger hunts. Along the way, children will trick or treat, share a story, a labyrinth walk, and crafts. A day you won't want to miss. Free with Garden Admission. For more information, visit www.brookgreen.org. And now for a commercial break. Bistro 90 serving only the finest in USDA prime, dry, aged steaks, fresh, not frozen seafood, homemade Italian cuisine. This may be the place for you with an incredible bourbon selection, crafted cocktails, cold beer. Bistro Nadi makes a sensational evening out. Located at 7209 Highway 90, this fine dining experience is just 20 minutes away from Tanger and the Main Street Connector. Call ahead for reservations. Bistro 90, 843-390-5151. Again, the number 843-590-5151. Bistro 90, a Carolina Bulletin top pick. Are you a geek, nerd, or sports fan? Shop for comic books, action figures, and custom decals, signs, or t-shirts at DJ's Decals, Toys, and More. Located in Inlet Square Mall at 10125 Highway 17 Bypass, Suite 62, Merle's Inlet, South Carolina, 29576. DJ's Decals is a Carolina Bulletin top pick business. Retroactive, located along the Charleston Boardwalk section of Broadway at the Beach, is your spot for all things nostalgia. Bring back the memories of your childhood while browsing through the unique store full of t-shirts, hoodies, games, mugs, toys, records, and much, much more. Retroactive carries the best in pop culture from the 70s, 80s, 90s, and beyond. Shop online at www.shopretroactive.com. Retroactive is a Carolina Bulletin top pick. If you haven't cleaned your car in a while, then you need to visit Scrubby's Car Wash. Voted Best Car Wash by Reader's Choice 2018 and 2019. Take advantage of their free vacuums and mat cleaners. Join their wash club starting from only $14.99 per month for the unlimited basic plan. Sign up today at Scrubby's Car Wash of Burles Inlet, South Carolina, or Scrubby's Car Wash of Lumberton, North Carolina. Scrubby's Car Wash is a Carolina Bulletin top pick business. Now for the traffic report with Swoopy. A motorcycle rider was killed in a Saturday crash on a Midlands road. 
Through October 6, 102 motorcyclists have died on state roads and highways compared to 88 in 2018, according to the South Carolina Department of Public Safety. Here are some important ways drivers can observe motorcycle safety. Always signal, check mirrors, and check blind spots. If you're driving a big truck or a van, you already know that your vision can be limited. Give them the whole lane. Treat motorcycle turn signals with caution. Give motorcycles extra following and passing distance. Back to you, Prombird. Thanks, Swoopy. I think if everyone takes an extra second to check their blind spots, then there would be a lot fewer accidents. And now for the weather with Therb and Mercury. I mean, uh, it's, it's really not so hot anymore. I mean, it's not as hot as it was in this... Hot in the summer! Hot in the summer! It's so hot in the summer! Thanks, Thurman. Why are you so lady? Fun fact! The first jack-o'-lanterns were made out of pumpkins. We were made out of turnips! Now for a commercial break. Rusty's Pool, Spa, and Backyard Design can design and construct the swimming pool or spa of your dreams. Call today, 910-474-3408 or 843-450-0210 for a free estimate. Servicing the coastal North Carolina and South Carolina area. Rusty's Pool, Spa, and Backyard Design is a Carolina Bulletin top pick business. CBD has become a viable and natural way to relieve pain, anxiety, and depression. It's also an excellent way to boost your overall health. Visit Coastal Green Wellness. Their knowledgeable staff will educate you on the vast benefits of CBD and how it could work for you. Coastal Green Wellness has three locations in Myrtle Beach. 2954 Howard Avenue at the Market Common. 1220 Highway 17 South in North Myrtle Beach. And their newest location, 201 West Ponce de Leon Avenue in Decatur, Georgia. Coastal Green Wellness is a Carolina Bulletin top pick. Professional Rehabilitation Services, the outpatient physical therapy specialists. Their services include manual therapy, vestibular therapy, orthopedics, sports medicine, dry needling, and spinal manipulation. Visit prsrehabservices.com for more info and to contact one of their eight offices in the Grand Strand. Get a free 15-minute consultation. Professional Rehabilitation Services is a Carolina Bulletin top pick business. The Library Restaurant has been a staple of the Myrtle Beach market since 1974. Now located at 6613 North Kings Highway in Myrtle Beach, the library is new and improved, jazzing it up with a charming speakeasy style lounge to better enjoy your favorite cocktails. Tuesdays at the bar, it's half price wine by the glass from 5 until 7. Every Wednesday, speak the secret password to your bartender and receive a 20% off your tab bar tab. Thursdays, happy hours include half price on select appetizers. Call ahead for reservations, table side service in our elegant dining room at 843 448 4527. Again, the number 843 843- 448-4527 The Library Restaurant A Carolina Top Pick Here's what's going on in local sports In college football, number 3 ranked Clemson improved to 7-0 on the season defeating Louisville 35-10 Travis Etienne rushed for 192 yards and Trevor Lawrence threw 3 touchdowns as the Tigers kept their unbeaten streak alive Meanwhile, down in Columbia, the Gamecocks were looking to upset the second top 10 team in back-to-back games for the first time ever However, a missed offensive interference penalty led to a Gator touchdown in the fourth quarter, and South Carolina never recovered from it, losing to number 9 ranked Florida by a score of 38-27. Despite tying the game up on a fourth quarter field goal, the Coastal Carolina Chanticleers lost a nail-biter to Georgia Southern in three overtimes, 30-27. CCU falls to 3-3 on the year. On to NFL news, after defeating the Tampa Bay Buccaneers 37-26 last week in jolly old England, the Carolina Panthers were off this week. The Panthers will have the work cut out for them as they take on unbeaten San Francisco next week in Santa Clara. In baseball news, looks like it'll be the Washington Nationals taking on the Houston Astros in this year's Fall Classic. You can purchase tickets for any of the World Series games by contacting OK Sports Marketing. Over to Dan G. Hilleman for the Crime Report. Here are the top crime stories in the Carolinas. 
The National Park Service says a bust of Oro Wright that was stolen from the Wright Brothers National Memorial on the North Carolina coast has been found. The reproduction bust was found on October 16th on the beach in Kill Devil Hills, North Carolina. An investigation continues into the theft as well as the damage to a granite base. Homeowners have been asked to review security footage for the suspicious activity. A family on vacation in South Carolina finds $600,000 worth of cocaine floating in a South Carolina beach. The family was enjoying Fripp Island's beach on October 6th when they came across a large dark object floating in the water, police said, that weighed 44 pounds. Investigators are still trying to determine the source of the package. Anyone who finds a suspicious package should report it immediately to the police, as they always, always, always need your help for some reason. Over to you, Prom Bird. Who would want to steal a bust and how did it wind up on a beach? <laughs> I guess it's a mystery that remains unsolved. And now a message from our sponsors. Ooze Pops are your best choice for all of your frozen refreshment needs. These mixed drinks on a stick include cocktails, martinis, wine, and even jello shots. Kids can also enjoy their non-alcoholic products. Follow them on Facebook to find their trucks in Charleston and in the Myrtle Beach area. See their menu at www.boozepop.com and contact for booking events. Veteran and locally owned, bringing communities together one booze pop at a time. Booze Pops is a Carolina Bulletin top pick. Are you looking for a professional to clean your home in Conway or Myrtle Beach? Call Mermaids at 843-936-0035. Services include residential cleaning services, basic cleans, deep cleans, and move-in or move-out cleans. Visit www.zmermaids.com to learn more. Mermaids is a Carolina Bulletin top pick business. Jimmy's Original Hibachi House, serving the Grand Strand for 20 years, has everything you want for fresh, made-to-order food. Steak, shrimp, sushi, hibachi, and of course, the famous $5 chicken bowls. Plus now you can customize your own poke bowls at the Pine Island Myrtle Beach location. See their menu at www.jimmyshibachi.com. Dine-in, take-out, or free delivery. Located on... 6108 North Kings Highway, Myrtle Beach, and 1780 Pine Island Road, Myrtle Beach. Jimmy's Original Hibachi House is a Carolina Bulletin top pick business. Sea Blue Restaurant and Wine Bar offers a South Beach feel right here in the heart of North Myrtle Beach. Master Chef Kenneth Norcott features contemporary American cuisine rooted in a classic French cooking technique. Come see why Sea Blue has won so many awards for its unique fine dining experience, including voted as the best restaurant in America by Open Table. Sea Blue is located at 501 Highway 17 North in North Myrtle Beach. Call ahead for reservations, 843-249-8800, 843-249-8800. Sea Blue Restaurant and Wine Bar is a Carolina Bulletin top pick. That's the news. I'm Prom Bird. Thanks for watching. And I'm LG, reminding everybody to stay dirty, Myrtle Beach.